compartmentalize it. That shot's gone. Don't worry about it. Concentrate on this one. 10-7 and a 10-8 from Hiltrop. Oh, my word, she is finding some form, isn't she? 10-6s in the last series. A 10-8 here. It's still too tight to call, though. 0.2 between these two athletes. I wonder what's going through their minds right now. Park, he can't let that frustration get to him. He can't start to even reflect on what has happened. Like you said, he's got to stay in this moment because otherwise the moment could get considerably worse. Well, yeah, you say what's going through their minds. Well, they will be saying, they would always say to you, hopefully nothing. Hopefully nothing. Sounds easy, doesn't it? Oh, but it's not. It really isn't, is it? And that is the situation. Our last shot, shot 24, unless they are level, of course, to decide our gold medal here at the Osaka shooting range. Clapping starts. The clock starts counting down. This, the half minute that decides whether you're a gold medalist or a silver medalist. And the accuracy of these two. Look at those final two shots. <laughs> it's not much room for improvement. 10.6 uh, from Hill Trop and a 10.7. Not quite enough from Park. It's just 0.1 the difference, but it is Germany. And Natasha Hilltrop, the 29-year-old, who will take gold. Well, what a surprise. Because at the end, it looked like Park was absolutely cruising to the goal. But in the end, that one shot, that 9.8, was all it took to drop him down into the silver medal place. It's his first medal in this uh, discipline at the Paralympic Games, so he may not be too disappointed, but, well, congratulations to Natasha Hilltrop. Gold medal here at the Paralympic Games in the mixed 10-metre air rifle prone SH1 category. Well, she will have been delighted to have gone one better than Rio. But this man has gone one better than his medal earlier in the week.